and another discovery, uh, this time coming from Belgium, all the way from Belgium, Mushroom Games. And, you know, if you thought that the Doctor is the only one who can do time travel, nope. Not this time. This time we have a game all about time traveling based with wizards. And I am with Pierre Emmanuel Legrand, who is the designer of a rather lovely, lovely looking game. Oh, no, congratulations, it's looking beautiful. What can you tell me about your game? Um, it's my first published game. Uh, it's um, a game that is a tournament about uh, wizards that spend time, you know. So that's why it's called Time Masters. Uh, and during this uh, tournament, when the tournament is uh, starting, the wizards that come in the tournament release their knowledge into five spheres of consciousness mm -hmm. that will be represented by five decks in the middle of the table. And then you will try to gather the more knowledge possible. And when two spheres are empty, the game is open. We declare, uh, I don't know the words, sorry for my English, <laughs> um, which one is the biggest wizard, the time masters. It's a deck building game. Now, there are a lot of deck building games out there at the moment. What makes yours unique? Um, one thing for me that really is important it's that when you gather one card, it will directly come into your hand. It will not go to your discard pile and you will not you know, discard all your hand at the end of the turn. You will just refill it. Okay. That's one thing. The other thing is that you manage uh, your resources out of the cards. It's not the cards that will tell you, okay, you will be able to do that or that. Indeed, there is the cost of the cards, but you will have the resource next to the cards, the tokens that will give you yeah, something to manage and also the possibility to play your cards. What's the difficulty level? Is it a, an entry level game or is this a game as gamers game? Um, it's not a really complicated game, but during your first two or three turns, it will be maybe a bit dark. But it's quite easy when you have passed this level. I mean, the, the booth is very busy. And I have seen an awful lot of people playing the game and they all seem to be having a lot of time. How long does it take to explain the game? If you know uh, what the deck building game is, it can go quite quickly. About um, five or ten minutes, depending on how the people react and understand the mechanic. But if you have someone that doesn't know the, the, what the deck building is, uh, you will, yeah, maybe take a quarter. Of an so it's not, it's not a long time. It's, it's a, it's a very accessible time. Yes, I think so. But the mechanics are quite simple. Also, the game looks beautiful. What was the, the, the artwork commissioning like? Because it's looking fantastic. How did you decide uh, how the game was going to look and feel? Um, this was a big discussion between. Uh, the editor, uh, the, the illustrator and me, because um, we wanted something special. We wanted a, a complete universe. Uh, it was not only the, the design that you see there, but we also uh, have written some histories about, uh, a real background, I mean, about the, the wizards that are in this tournament and, and things like that. Look, this, uh, yeah, it was quite, some time to discuss and to to choose from. There was some uh, characters that has been designed uh, by the uh, illustrator that have been, uh, you know, uh, drawn. Um, but s some characters, I, I said, no, no, that is not from this universe. It's more like, you know, about warriors and things like that. No, I don't want this in this universe. I want only wizards, but not only the wizard like, uh, you know, uh, with the, this ad and... You know, not Gandalf. You know, indeed, <laughs> not Gandalf. <laughs> not at all. <laughs> now, um, the game has been released now. It's, it's, can people can buy it at Essen, but obviously people watching the video will not be able to be at Essen. How can people buy this game? Um, right now, there is some boxes in English. I don't know where, we can, where you can buy that now. So people can, they, they have to keep an eye on your website and so they can get it. And, and what's next for you? Because this is your first game. Yeah. What, what do you have in mind now? Um, I'm developing other games, designing new mechanics, and also uh, I'm working on expansions for Time Masters. Okay. Yeah. We'll see more from you. <laughs> yeah, I hope so. <laughs> well, I look forward to that. Thank you very much indeed. Best of luck with the game. I, I, I know it's going to be absolutely fantastic, so many congratulations in advance. Well done. Thank you.